Hello, everybody. Martin Tyler is my name. Alan Smith is his name alongside me. And we're hoping to bring you some fine action from this game today. Not will play today, and they play Paris Saint-Germain. Do you think we'll get some tempo to the game today? It's billed as a friendly. Well, I hope so. I mean, that's a, if there's no tempo to it, Martin, it'd be a waste of time. So that's something the managers will be after. Well, they're certainly the side to beat in France these days, aren't they, Paris Saint-Germain? Certainly wasn't always the case. No, that's true. But uh, they've had some good managers here and certainly attracted plenty of very good players. Zlatan Ibrahimovic, of course, being one of the most famous. And now he's looking for some support. Right in quickly to try and win the ball back. He's controlling the play here. His teammates just borrow the ball for a few moments. Goes for goal! Great chance, and he's wasted it. Thiago Silva. Well, he's playing it back to the goalkeeper. position they've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now nowhere near the goal actually good running off the ball in support first touch was good but he's got to work hard to keep the ball And he goes for goal! Could it be? And he's put it into the bottom corner. So after the goal, we've opened the scoring here, 1-0. Colbert. Well, they've been uh, thwarted here. That's a sign of better things to come. And quickly back to his feet. This is his situation, isn't it? Looking for a goal. Oh, he's got support here. It was an easy save because he was able to plot the path of the ball all the way into his hands. Could whip it in from here. In with a chance. And there was the chance to level the score. Well, the crowd were up on their feet, fully expecting that one to be bulging the net. Colbert. With this goal advantage, they've now got a corner. Shot doesn't get very far, blocked away. Now they can go forward, having won the ball. Zlatan Ibrahimovic.
And there is some uh, backup for him in this position. And hits it. That goal seems to have given him an extra yard of pace, an extra injection of confidence. Yeah, his movement, the defenders just can't handle it at the moment. And that's a turnover in play. Colbert. Attacking well here. Now across Angel Di Maria. And he's got his block in and the cross doesn't get into the middle. Maxwell. Well, this is a brilliant opening. Marvellous tackle. This is an opportunity for them to break out from the back. Didn't hesitate, did he, with that challenge? Got the ball now under control and a chance to move themselves forward, get up the pitch. Opportunity here, what a chance! It's a good strike and it's matched by the save. Well, they're a goal up, now they've got a corner here. Oh, a volley! Good chance not taken. A lot of financial resources behind this team, Paris Saint-Germain. At the moment, the backers will be thinking that maybe they backed a loser here because the scoreline tells you they are behind and the shape of the game tells you that unless they improve, they're going to really struggle in the second half as well. Oh, I love to see that, the referee playing the advantage. Passing is top class. Oh, he's going to shoot now. I don't know what part of the ball he connected with, but it wasn't the right part, was it? It wasn't. He sliced it, he skewed it, whatever it was. He didn't hit the centre of that ball. Well, an awful lot of pressure on the player shooting, and it told with a finish. Well, that's half-time at 1-0. Well, the underdog has uh, done half of the job, I suppose, but there'll be a tough second half to come. They lead at the break. Yeah, they've got to be absolutely delighted with their efforts in that first half. The difficult thing, as always, is sustaining it because they have put in an awful lot of effort. Are they fit enough? It's Paris Saint-Germain who start this second period. Angel Di Maria. Important challenge now, he must get the ball away. That looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. Colbert, chance for the cross. Zlatan Ibrahimovic came in with the challenge and the ball broke free. He's got to play it back to the goalkeeper. Thiago Silva.
Colbert. And the attacker coming away with help on either side. Latin Ibrahimovic. It's looking good, this move. He's got space. Got to be. He's hit that perfectly. And the keeper's done well to keep it out. Harry Saint-Germain have a corner now. And that will be an opportunity for them maybe to get level. They've got to do it to try and get themselves back into the match. Trailing at the moment, but an extra forward, it could make the difference. Oh, yeah, he's got some solid work from the goalkeeper. Chose to punch. That's no sort of challenge from the defender. Excellent control in a tight area. It's an exhibition here with such great passing. The opposition back off, they could be in trouble when the ball gets to here. He's got to score! Could it be? But there it is, the equaliser. Well, we're back at level pegging again at 1-1. He could cross it now. Gone in strongly. Thiago Silva. Stop the attack, that. In quickly. Could be dangerous. Well read by the defender to intercept. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. In a goal. Crisp defending there. And the player coming on is Pastore, Javier Pastore, who is probably good enough to get in most teams starting 11, but not into this team on this day. Supporting player alongside. Close range chance. That's a goalkeeper out quickly. And he's just plunged onto the ball there. Yeah, that's top class from, from him. And uh, really did help out his defenders there. Attacking now. He committed himself here, there wasn't much cover, but he got the ball, the defender, in the wide position. Still a chance in this epic game for one side to get a winning goal, but not that much longer. And he read their minds, brilliant defending in the circumstances. Well, that's a clever little clip into a teammate.
Maxwell. Well, the clock is ticking on, two minutes of play left. He's going to cross it. Here's the cross. Well, that looked promising, but he's been stopped. And it's come to an end now as the referee blows the whistle for the last time. Well, nothing at stake in terms of league points or cup progress today, but a good workout for the team. They've got a draw from it. Yeah, and I think fitness-wise, they would have both benefited. Not the best of football being shown out there, but it just did lack a slight edge to it.